Good morning and welcome to The Locker Room. Coach Ack here and today's message is change your tune. Have you ever broken out into song on the subway? Have you ever done a dance in the middle of your office? Have you ever gone to Starbucks and ordered something new? Research into how we think has shown that people with a growth mindset believe that intelligence grows over time, while others believe that personality and intelligence are fixed. What this research has shown is that people who believe they can grow take a different thought track that leads to success. Most of this success comes from the belief that we can get better. That by itself is a huge advantage in any undertaking. According to Dr. Carol Dweck, when people face obstacles, the ones who believe they can learn and grow believe they can beat their challenges through hard work and coaching. Someone who doesn't see the world that way hits a wall and thinks they're simply not equipped to power through. The safe path, which is traveled by average thinkers, is to avoid challenges at all cost. Of course, this perceived safety is at the expense of personal growth. Those who feel that they're already set on their path give up easily and feel that extra effort isn't going to produce results. They typically don't take even constructive criticism well and feel threatened when others do well around them. What kind of thinker are you? Someone with a growth mindset embraces challenges. They persist in the face of setbacks. They view hard work and persistence as keys to improvement. They learn from criticism. They find success and inspiration in others' success. So how do we get ourselves out of our old thinking and into that possibility mindset? What has worked most often for me is to force myself outside my comfort zone. A comfort zone is really nothing more than a prison for our growth. The number one fear people have is of public speaking. And I remember deciding when I was in eighth grade to begin competing in speech. Talk about diving into the deep end. I've trained people in my business to learn to come out of their shell by asking them to introduce themselves to three strangers and bring back three interesting facts about each person. No matter what it is that you're fighting in yourself, it's important to push past it. Once you do, your whole mindset will change, and we know what an open, positive mindset can do for us. In our business, we start our weekly meetings with music and dancing. I've been doing this a long time, but I remember the first time I saw this, I thought it was nuts. I mean, dancing? In a meeting? And I know you can probably tell I don't have a lot of moves. It might seem crazy what I'm about to but I decided to smile and just go with it, and it took me to a whole new place mentally. That opened up a world of possibility. If you push yourself outside your comfort zone cage, you'll be amazed at the capacity you have for growth in so many areas. Make that a habit, and for sure, you'll be living your very best life. Thanks for joining me in the locker room, guys. We'll see you back here real soon. Make it an amazing day. If you've enjoyed and feel the Daily Locker Room has served as an inspiration in your life, why not share it with a friend by sending them the daily message? 